I wish I could have thought for you what just happened, but I was sitting at my desk eating really, really quick because my next client that's coming always comes early, and this is why we ask that you don't come early. Not all of us, but some of us like for you to come on time. Anyway, it's my own fault. I'm eating, and I'm eating really fast, and I have rice, and I have a disposable spoon. Don't come at me. And I go to like lay my iPad up here, and I hit the spoon and it does this <laughs> and there's rice in the spoon. I was gonna grab for my camera but I didn't want to be filming cleaning up the mess and then have her come in. So anyway, oh, she's not here yet. I'm really full <laughs> and I think I have all the rice cleaned up. Three more clients might go to the grocery store after this um realized over christmas um like i haven't filmed a lot and partially it's because i wasn't feeling well uh so i got glutened <laughs> over christmas and i did start a vlog over christmas i'm like told you guys all about that and then i scrapped it i was feeling so awful and just didn't want to be filming or I wasn't in any place to film so yeah I'm realizing that being gluten-free is non-negotiable so I'm just kind of rethinking the way I do things a little bit and one of them is making sure I have stuff in the house so I'm not like oh poor me there's nothing here I can eat because I am a toast person I go straight to toast all day every day that was you know like a couple of months ago up until a couple of months ago that was my go-to but since that's gone i just really really try really hard so right now my go-to is the pinty's gluten-free uh chicken nuggets and i got an air fryer so like 10 minutes i can have these beautiful chicken nuggets and the other thing is the mm, i don't know what the brand is but the the certified gluten-free um oats oatmeal i'm i'm a huge oatmeal i'm a huge apple person so that makes me an oatmeal person if you get my drift uh and the next thing is rice cakes with honey and peanut butter but i literally have to lay off that sometimes i'm having my rice cake situation like twice or three times a day we need to back off that maybe or i'm gonna make myself sick of them and i really don't want that because i love them so very much i gotta get moving my client's gonna be here i need to finish setting up hey guys welcome back it is the next day and i am currently cutting these off so i've got my garbage can right here and i am clipping these do as i say not as i do there is a reason why some of us i don't want to speak for all nail technicians tell you not to cut them and it actually just happened to me which is why i come on here because i was like i need to i need to make a point to tell you guys but if you cut them and if you happen to catch them the wrong way which can totally happen to anyone whenever they will crack down on your natural nail and it will hurt so don't do it ow remove Ow, remove them the right way. I have a pair of clippers here that I use basically just for that. So I am going to just file these down. The reason why I'm doing it, they're quite long. Holy Lord, they're quite long. They um, had gotten quite long, needed filled, and I am tattooing on Monday for sure, hopefully Sunday and Monday. And I just didn't want the long nail in the way. I'm, I'm sure it obviously would have been fine. I've done a lot of work for a lot of years with long nails, but it just didn't feel right. Especially with them needing filled anyway, I was like, I'm just gonna take the opportunity right now just to, that didn't help at all, just to take them off. So let's get these glasses clean. I can't even see right now. On a thin piece of paper Would it make any difference? Would it change for the better? If I wrote you a poem 
if I posted a letter. Hey guys, welcome back. Today I am tearing down my room. It is another day. I am gonna be tattooing tomorrow, which is Monday. Today, I am doing the tear down of my room. This is like, this is the part that I hate. Tearing it down, I, I might hate setting it back up more. I'm gonna blast the music, which means you guys are gonna get some cleaning footage. And I'm gonna get this done. I have an event to go to at 12. It is seven minutes after 11. We're doing it. We're just gonna do it. Is it maybe because I never knew quite where I was and suddenly you told me maybe you lost but I am too whatever the cost we'll make it through tell me you're the one you're the one for me now cause what am I supposed to do if you are not the one not the one for me then tell me now what I could do okay I think I've been talking about this for a while but I think while I have my vehicle parked right up front and everything tore apart I'm going to take this tree home and put it in the shower. It is so dirty. And I don't know if you can tell, but there are so very many leaves. And I've tried wiping them. It's been unsuccessful. I just think it really needs a bath. I don't know if it's more work than what it's worth to take it home. I don't think so. I think I will take it home though. It, it truly does need some sort of miracle. As much hard work as it's going to be to get it home, not hard work, just bother. Actually not as tall as it looks. I have it, it's uh, it's in its own pot, and then it was in another white pot, it's Ikea. And I have the white pot flipped upside down and the tree on it to make it taller because it was just, just looked at the time too short for that space. I have, let me move you, these massive white, no, clear garbage bags that I was using, or I'm using, for tattooing to cover uh, one of my processes. I am going to, it like literally stands waist height on me. Move this cord, I don't know why I would pick today to do this, I'm in a hurry. Which is exactly why I would pick today to do this. I mean, literally, while the room is literally empty. Okay, I'm just getting done tattooing. I finished setting up yesterday and didn't quite take you guys with me because the battery on my camera went dead. But I'm gonna reset up my nail room right now and get it ready for the week. And then I'm gonna go get a haircut and go get groceries. So I hope you have a lovely week. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. That always helps my channel and I appreciate you and I will see you next time.